In this video, I'm going to talk about hexadecimal binary conversion chart that I found from the same book that I'm reading. Reading, so I mean, uh, called CCNP routing and switching route. 300-101 official short guide by Kevin Wallace. So same book. So I found this chart and I thought that this would be, I mean, this would be a, to a good topic to talk about because sometimes, you know, we forget how to, you know, uh, do this kind of conversion. So, <clears throat> so uh, as you may know that. Uh, IPv6, as you may know, IPv6 addresses are composed of uh, hex numbers, not not uh, decimal numbers. So, for example, this IPv6 here, <coughs> uh, each character or digit is actually a hex number, not a decimal number. So, I'm going to talk about this a little later, but uh, for now, let's just uh, focus on this chart here. Uh, so, I've got hex, binary, hex, binary. So, this is just, uh, you know, count, uh, this second uh, column here, set of columns, hex and binary, is just continuation of this first two uh, columns. So, uh, it is, uh, I mean, hex uh, is actually uh, starts, I mean, hex starts from zero through F. So zero, this is the you know conversion to binary, uh, and so on and so forth. So as you can see here, um, uh, you know, after nine, it's not actually ten, but uh, it's the letter A, uh, A uh, through F. So A B C D E F. So F is 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay, so 15. <coughs> Just uh, uh, double checking. So uh, these are actually six, 16 digits, right? <coughs> so, and this is the uh, conversion of these hex uh, characters <coughs> here. So uh, I'm not gonna. I'll talk about, you know, the, I'm not going to talk about this in very detail, but, you know, you can just uh, look at the, look at this chart and, you know, uh, figure it out for yourself how a decimal is converted into uh, the binary, right? <clears throat> so here at the bottom, I, I, uh, I written two conven conventions. This actually uh, the conventions that you can use to uh, for you to write uh, an IP address, an IPv6 address uh, to uh, a short version into a short version. So, for example, this IPv6 here, uh, you can use these two conventions to make this IPv6 uh, IPv6 shorter. So, number one is omit the leading zeros in any given quartet. And by the way, each, each segment, like this, F, E, 0, 0, uh, 0, 0, 0, 0, these are called quartets. Um, so, Again, omit the leading zeros in any given quartet. So basically, for example, <coughs> uh, in this one, two. So, for example, in this uh, short version, I omitted three zeros, uh, three uh, leading zeros uh, in this quartet. So I just wrote <coughs> two instead of zero zero two. So so that's an example of how you do number one. And number two is repeat one or more consecutive, I mean, represent one or more consecutive quartets of all zero of all hex zeros with double column. So 
And you can only do this once in an IP address. Yeah, but only one such occurrence in a given address. So, like I said, you just you can just do it in a single IP address. Okay. So let's talk about this IP address here in detail. So, like I said earlier, uh, uh, the each section is called quartet, quartet, and each uh, character is actually a hex, uh, yeah, a hex number, <clears throat> and it is organized to eight quartets. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and separated by a column. Uh, but of course, if you uh, uh, you know uh, represent, I mean, if you think of uh, bits, this you know, if you count this and convert, I mean, if you convert this these hex decimals here into bits, uh, it's gonna be one twenty eight bits. <clears throat> so that's why it's called. 128-bit uh, IPv6 address. So, uh, as you can see, um, I got uh, two versions here. Uh, this is one version, so you can, you know, you can use these two conventions to just uh, omit, omit. I mean, that's gonna be actually that's gonna be number two. Uh, represent one or more consecutive quartets of all hex zeros with double column. So instead of writing all uh, the, you know, these two quartets, uh, I just wrote double column. And of course, I omit the leading zeros, so I just wrote two. Uh, and you can't, you cannot do, uh, <clears throat> you know, this double column here twice in an IP address. So you just have to omit the leading zeros uh, from these. Uh, in this quartet, so we just wrote zero, column zero, column zero, column fifty-eight. Of course, I omitted uh, the leading zeros there. And number two, I mean the other, you know, version of short, the other short version is this. Uh, so as you can see, I omitted the leading zeros. So I just wrote zero, column zero, and column zero, and I used this, you know, convention here, number two convention. I just wrote double column and omitted uh, the you know two leading zeros before fifty eight. So that's it for uh, hexadecimal and binary conversion conversion chart and how you would <coughs> write an IP an IPv6 address into a short version IP address. So yep. That's it. And that's it in this video. Thanks for watching. Bye.